Hello, and welcome back to another episode of Conscript. I hope you're doing well, looking after yourselves. So, today, we have got to raid the front lines. Because we failed in the previous episode. We got all the way to the end, and then we died. They said to be my brave and valiant soldiers. Take a look and see what the Bosch have done to our motherland. These monsters, they will not stop until the last drop of our French blood is spilled. If they are victorious on this battlefield, they will take their knife to the heart of France. But these devils don't realise that it is them that will soak their seized fields red. There will be no surrender, there will be no defeat. We will fight until the last of our men are standing. It is time to drive them home once and for all. Get ready. Man, I couldn't imagine that, having a picture of like your daughter or somebody in one hand, or, or your wife. And one bullet in the other. Right, let's go. I don't think I could do it. Well, I just my mind wouldn't be able to take it. I'm not mentally strong enough for it. Uh, uh. Oh, so they take rifle rounds again. Okay. you've been doing the lay lemon and coins come on bad charge we can do this For France! Nothing in there. Abandoned your post. So you can abandon your post there. I wonder what apps they do. Dude. Why have you got so much HP? Let's try out the elephant gun, shall we?
Man! Help! He's coming for me! I know it's only got one shell on it, but... I don't really want to kill these guys because I'm pretty sure there's bad karma in this game. Oh, karma is pretty whack already. See nothing. Where are we? Be nice if I had my flashlight. Cigarettes. Don't really need the gunpowder. Uh, a set of German flamethrowers. them. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, there's too many of them! Ooh, what does he have on him? Now the game's just trying to make me feel bad. Uh, map taken. Chemical fluid. Some cigarettos. Apparently my inventory is full. Well, considering we're not using the pistol at the minute, we might as well just fucking get rid of that. Uh, 
put the cam fluid back. Take the fabric. Doing pretty good at the minute on and stuff, so please do not tell me that somebody with a flamethrower. Gonna blow. Can I pick up his limb, bro? Uh, we may as well see what's around here, haven't we? Fabric shells. Ah oh, man, this is gonna be dark as shit. Isn't it? I can't see a fucking thing. Should have brought my flashlight. Oh, if I had a small key, I could have unlocked that as well. I do have one, but it's in my um. Mate, I would like to help you. But I don't think the game's going to give me the option. Red fabric, a piece of his scarf. I'm coming for you, brother. You know, actually, I would go to war. Not because the guys, not because my country would need me, but if they were enrolling people, I would 
vote to go myself to go instead of my brothers having to go. I would rather go through all that pain and torment than put them have to go through it, if that makes sense. Play the piano? Our family piano, one day I'll learn to play. actually leave the farm uh, the old military truck that belonged to our father it hasn't worked since before he died apparently uh, we've got the salad key again, again. If you're having a hard time seeing anything, don't worry, I am as well. Hey, brother! Fucking hell, mate. You scared the shit out of me. Ma, I haven't seen her. She's probably out with Suzanne again. Oh, and I forgot to tell you yesterday. Wait, I'm late for my lessons tonight. I'll tell you later. Pierre's journal. Read the journal. Out of respect for him, no. Although, do we need to read the journal in order to progress? Uh, fell very ill over Christmas, spent the week in bed, worst of it has passed. Hold father's watch in my bed, keeps me lucky and healthy. Those are my superstition anyway, I, it can be hard for me to believe it. No way to spend the holidays, we'll be going soon as well. Eugene's father thinks the war will be over by summer anyway. So next year I'll have a better Christmas. December 28th, 1915. Drew Ma today, wasn't happy with the first attempt, so I tried again. The faces are still hard. At least she'd stay still. But a beautiful old woman. I thought he had lessons. Why is he not in the room? Rest for the day. Chapter 4. Chapter 5. The World's Blood Pump. I'm coming for you, brother. Find a way to Fort Vart. Alright, we haven't got any... We haven't got any... Uh... Any 
I ain't got a map. We do have a map. So are we like off grid now or something? Away from the commanding officers and shit. This is written in German. My German isn't good enough to read it. Saws and buckets of blood. Stimulant. Nice. So I can, um... Use the stimulant. That's what I wanted to do. It's a lot of dead bodies. I wonder how many people were actually killed during World War One, two. Uh, this is written in German, but German isn't good enough to read it. A soldier's French-German dictionary. This should help you read German phrases and sentences. Nice. I don't know where the hell I'm going to be going now. I mean, we've pushed the enemy line back, so... We're in a town. Surely this should be a French town. Key is required to the tinsmith. Okay. Okay. Right, so we need a key for that. So, so it looks like anywhere we go, we need a bloody key. Wash house. Wait a minute, what's in here? Combine it. I don't need all these bloody medkits, man. I need to find a save room or something.
Go, Bartz. That door's open. There you are, mate. What will it be? What I want to know is how the fuck do you keep getting around so much? I think we could kind of put that gun away now. I need the torch wherever it is. Where's my torch? Another bandage, holy crap man, we are running across. We are in the town. What the fuck is this? Why is there a sun dial on the floor? Maybe we'll head back up the other way then. Wrong way. Right, I need to remember there's a sundial there. Uh, various academic books on prosthetic limbs and prosthetic features. I'll draw. We do have a key for that. Pile of prosthetic arms. Key is required. Not taking any more prosthetic requests at this time, thank you. Okay. 
Stimulant. Use. Lovely job, mate. Alright, let's get out of it. Right, sundial. Holy shit, this town is big. Lock, lock, locked. Door. Door, door. Gunfire. Right, we need to find the cure. Oh no, a minute, what's that? That was Sundial. Nearly a full moon. Sundial, nearly a full moon. There's got to be a reason for them being around. Mother's Journal, January 3rd, 1916. Cloud has been working overtime every day. My poor husband, he is getting work to the bone. The army needs him to make the equipment they need. Swords, cannon parts, shovels, axes. It never stops. They just keep asking for more. I can't take it anymore. Things seem to be getting worse every day. Apparently they are approaching from the north and our town is directly in their way. A shell hit a farm only a few hundred meters away from us this past week. It feels like this town could be run through any day now. What will become of everything? I've locked the front door just in case with a combination locked. The code is... The number of my boys with freckles. The number of my boys that wear glasses. The number of my boys that like having a mustache. And the number of boys... Definitely something in there. How do I find out how many children you've had, lady? Empty square indentation. Right. Go down there. Old one mattress looks recently used. Has someone been hiding under here? The wash house key. Dead fucker. Alright, where's the wash house? Fireman's Digna, combination lock, 
church, town, town hall, the wash house is there, so I need to go down and around. That's you, Blade. Fuck me, that's a lot of enemies. Ah, uh, I can just sneak on by. Fuck. Oh god. My god, there's another one up there. Hey, seriously? Should have just snuck on by. Diamond key. Head over this way because we can get killed two birds with one stone over. Mate, there's going to be rats in a minute. Oh, fuck me, and there's enemies all over the place. Kid, there it is. Yours. Hey, come on, come on, come on. Oh, I know what this is. <sighs> right, number of boys with freckles. One, two, three. And then it was like number. What is it again? Let 
number of freckles, number of wear glasses, number that have mustache, number of boys. Right, so the N1 is four. So it's three, one, Three, one, two, four. Three, one, two, four. Okay. Three, one. Actually, was there anything else in there? I needed to check. I just fucking walked out of there like, you know, oh, we got password. Let's just go. Every day, more and more of our boys are coming back disfigured and unrecognizable, which means every day I'm getting more and more requests. I'm not sure how much longer I can keep up with this. I'm going to move to a bed into my office so I can keep up with the demands. All right, and I've just lost, I've forgotten the fucking passcode already. One, two, three, one, three, one, two, four. Why is it all the way up here? Uh, Tinsmith Key. Lovely fucking jubbly. Right, where's Tinsmith? Door diamond insignia. I mean, where's. Uh, locked door. Church. Town Hall, Tinsmith. I mean, we're down this way, so we might as well just fucking carry on going down, anyway. need fuel. Fabric I could possibly do with. Shelf is lined with old ointments. Have free health vials are hidden. Ooh, no, but at least we know where there's a health vial that we can use now. Uh. 
But the game's chucking healer lines at me now. That guy's a weaver. Rusted crank. Oh, fuck me. Fuck me. Get out of there. Gun parts. Sun slate. Crystal. We've got a rusted crank, which I don't know what the fuck is for, and we've also got a sun slate. I know where the sun slate goes. Well, I thought I did at least. I need to go back and sell this ruby as well. Right. Right, well, I am going to end this episode here, but thank you all very much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed it. We will pick this up again in a couple of days' time. So until then, look after yourselves, stay well, and I will catch you in the next episode. So thank you all very much for watching. Bye-bye! Right. Oh, shit. Three of them!